Morning Park family, as we continue our journey to 100 years of faith, we pause to salute the life of Mrs. Ollie Thornwell Moton. Mrs. Moton is the oldest mother of the church. She was born on May 15, 1908 to Mr. and Mrs. Jim Thornwell and had four sisters and three brothers. Mrs. Moten was educated in Charlotte, graduating from Second Ward High School, the first public high school for blacks in North Carolina. Soon after completing her schooling, she went to work for the Bagby family. Mrs. Moten was a loyal and loving employee for many years before retiring in the 1980s. In the 1930s, she was united in marriage to a prominent member of Guilfield Baptist Church. That was Mr. Ivy Moten. They were married for over 40 years when he died in 1984. Mrs. Moten has been a member of the Park Church for more than 65 years. During this time, she has been instrumental in the birth of at least two ministries. These are the Missionary Department and the Jail Ministry. She was also actively involved in several auxiliaries of the church, including the Usher Board, Missionary Society, Sunday School, and the Deaconess Board. On May 15th, Mrs. Moten will be 105 years young. Earlier this week, I was able to sit with Ms. Moten and present her with a plaque which celebrated over 65 years of service to the Park Church and 105 years of life. Okay, Park Church, help me celebrate Miss Moten and all the mothers in our congregation. On this Mother's Day, we celebrate the life and legacy of Mrs. Ollie T. Moten, along with other mothers of the church who have played various roles in the growth of our church, which is almost 100 years old. Through their prayers, their service, their love for our pastor, we have been able to do ministry for almost 100 years. We thank God for what he has been able to accomplish through them. 100 years is a significant milestone, and as we celebrate our mothers, we celebrate the rich history of our church. So we want you to get excited about all that is planned for this banner year. So help us to prepare by telling us all that God has done in your family's life as we continue through this journey. Whether you've been here over 60 years like Mother Moten, or you are new to our congregation, we want to hear what God has done in your life through this rich heritage called the Park Church. So send us your story on Facebook or email us at centennial at upbc.org. I'm Doris Wilson, and this has been our special Centennial Moment.